And now people all across the country are asking, what can I do to help? Jamon Terry is live outside the American Red Cross office in Detroit. The chapter is ready to assist, but a lot of folks here in Detroit are waiting on word as to what they should do. Jermont, what are some of the answers? Well, Steve, I can tell you that the images coming out of um, Houston most definitely captivates your attention. And for one local pastor here in Detroit, he is glued to the coverage, just hoping to get a glimpse of his unaccounted loved ones who live right in the path of Hurricane Harvey. Incomplete calls mount to constant worry. I'll take it as it comes, if it's tomorrow, whenever. Daryl Harris frantically waits for word from his cousin's whereabouts in Houston. I'm worried. He talked to Barbara Neal Keyes on Thursday, the day before Harvey hit. If things at the first sighting that things looked as if they were going really bad, to please promise me that she would just go ahead and just leave. Uh, and she made me that promise. He prays it's a promise kept because since Friday, no one in the family has heard from his cousin. As he watches the devastation in Houston, one image stands out most, this highway underwater, the one he traveled to get to his cousin's house when he visited this summer. Harris knows she lives a mile from this interstate. If her house is anywhere in that vicinity, it's definitely covered with water. Harris is a man of faith, and he's leaning on God. Maybe she left the charger, maybe she left the cell phone. There hasn't been many casualties reported, but Harris would like to know where those evacuated escaped to. I've not seen any news feeds that says these are the people who made it out. Until then, he waits for his phone to ring and a chance to embrace her once again. I just, I would love to just know that she's okay. And we are hoping the best for Harris and his family that they get that phone call from his cousin in Houston. And of course, there are many ways that you can help the American Red Cross being one way. And they've set up a very easy way to donate. All you have to do is text Harvey to 90999 and you can give a $10 donation or even more. And you know that the money will go towards all those who are truly in need in Houston. For now, reporting live outside the American Red Cross in Midtown, Jermont Terry, Local 4.